Reporting is a valuable tool for any organization. In this video, I'll highlight what you can expect when using reports in version 13 for Sugar Enterprise and Sugar Cell. We'll start with viewing reports. You'll notice that the report result view has a new look and feel with consolidated report actions and options. The new viewer fills the screen with the information you care about while tucking away less used options and actions into easy to access menus. You'll see any runtime filters you've added to your report here, making it quick and easy to update the data you're viewing on the fly. Make any necessary changes, click Apply, and you'll see Report Update in real time. You can also click this button to see a visual representation of your report filters. The actions you can take on a report are available in the top right within the Action menu. Here, you can edit, share, duplicate, schedule, and so on. You'll notice we've improved how you can schedule reports as well. You can now include charts and embed report results directly within the body of your emails, making it quick and easy for others to see the information you're sharing. You can use the buttons in the top right of the screen to manage your view. You can toggle on or off the filters, choose whether or not the report table or chart are visible, and if you have both the table and the chart on the screen, you can use these buttons to control whether your report is displayed with a horizontal or vertical split screen. You also have the flexibility to drag the splitter in the middle of the screen to expand or shrink the chart or table. For data tables, we've added frozen headers, resizable columns, and optional frozen first columns for our summation reports and rows and columns reports. We've also added focus drawer icons to our rows and columns reports. This makes it so that you can take action directly from your report. In version 13, we've also improved the way you can interact with your reports throughout the application. Previously known as the Saved Reports Chart Dashlet, the new report dashlet provides a context-aware experience as well as tables and runtime filters allowing you to have quick access to key information at a glance without having to navigate to the reports module. The report dashlet allows for greater control of how your reports are represented on your dashboards. You can toggle the options for your chart, data table, and filters. The new sort options also allow for custom leaderboards that drive performance and leverage gamification. This new dashlet also allows you to select reports that do not have a chart associated, such as a rows and columns report. When viewing a report, clicking into a segment of the chart will take you to a list of the data within that segment. Hover over a record and you'll see the focus drawer icon appear. Click on the icon and the focus drawer will appear and provide insight into that record. We've also made the report dashlets context aware when added to a record or focus drawer dashboard meaning they only show results related to the current record. For example, this dashlet shows all one opportunities for this account grouped by the quarter they were closed. You can set this up by adding a report to your focus drawer or record dashboard via the reports dashlet. Check the related to current record checkbox and this will ensure that the dashlet pulls the data for the record you're viewing. Lastly, we've also continued to build visualizations for our Cell Premier users. For instance, they can leverage the Forecast Changes Dashlet to see how their forecast has changed over the last seven days. You're able to see the total pipeline at the beginning and end of the reporting period, meaning the blue bars, as well as any increases, decreases, and close one opportunities in between. There's also the new Forecast Tracker Visualization. This dashlet allows you to visually track how your forecast, commitment, and one sales have progressed over the course of the sales period. And that's our quick overview of what you can expect when reporting in version 13 for Sugar Cell and Sugar Enterprise.